The revelations, at least on the surface, seem to support the more than 25 women who have accused Bill Cosby of sexual assault. Complete validation across the board for, from all of us. Complete validation. The comedian has never faced criminal charges and he has vehemently denied any wrongdoing. However, in a 2005 deposition, Cosby admitted under oath that he got a sedative for the purpose of giving it to women with whom he wanted to have sex. Arguably, this statement, which was made within the statute of limitations within the last 10 years, could be used by a DA or a prosecutor to bring charges against him. He's got real legal jeopardy at this point, which is why he's fighting this. Only selected portions of the transcript were released this week. They show attorney Dolores Troiani asking Cosby, quote, when you got the quaaludes, was it in your mind that you were going to use these quaaludes for young women that you wanted to have sex with? Cosby answers yes. Troiani then asks if Cosby ever gave the drugs to women without their knowledge. His lawyer objects, and Cosby never answers the question. Cosby then tries to clarify, saying, quote, I misunderstood woman, not women. The documents also give Cosby's account of a meeting with a woman in Las Vegas in the 1970s. Cosby said, quote, she meets me backstage, I give her quaaludes, we then have sex. But the account does little to clarify what happened, whether the woman whose name is redacted ingested the drugs or whether she consented to the sex. During the deposition, Cosby never answers questions about whether women took the drugs from him knowingly or whether they took them at all. I'm Andrew Spencer reporting.